I got a posing force custom map for you today. Uh, OP4 Warzone. I guess it's just Warzone, but you know, the title even on the place I downloaded it called it OP4 Warzone. So I'm calling it OP4 Warzone. Uh, created by someone named Master07. I think they're Russian. Um, I really don't know anything else about this map. I don't know, like any of the inspiration. The author didn't really say anything, so it's 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 just here. Uh, this is actually a pretty good map. Uh, the thing is, it's one of those maps where it looks really kind of basic, and I don't want to say amateurish, but you know, it just looks like someone's kind of one of the, someone's first maps. And it certainly, this is like I'm not saying this map even looks that bad. The lighting's actually kind of nice, but then you actually start playing it. And you realize that there's actually a lot going for it. Like, whoever designed it actually quite understood, like, what they were doing and had a very distinct idea in mind. I will say this, though. This map's only good for about two to four people. I have a sneaking suspicion this is supposed to be something like a dual map. Uh, but no, with four people, you can have quite a bit of fun. And we're just going to jump in. It's day. I should mention before I go, dated to uh, November 11, 2013. So... You know, people were making maps, of, like, you know, just proof that people were making maps for these games long and long after they were done and released and, you know, all that. So, as you can see, the thing is that this map, a good chunk of it is this very open kind of courtyard area. I don't know what you'd want to call it. Um, you got some cover and stuff, though, to take advantage of. And there's actually only one sniper rifle, so, you know, it could have just been, like, you know, all snipers and just been totally camp heaven but you know it's got some like you know variety to it so let's start with the corner here you got a freaking mp40 so that's that's i already like that you know that's already good for me uh you got some health to pick up here you got this kind of none of the boxes you can break by the way nor can you get on top as far as i'm aware if you come back here you got this kind of area you can hide uh which would be a very good spot too if you know you can control this area you can snipe through there but the sniper rifle isn't here so thank god for that the sniper rifle is actually over here. We'll get to it. You got the shotgun in the corner, which I always forget about, but, you know, don't don't forget about it. And obviously, here you go. You got the sniper rifle in the corner here, which is good because, you know, this isn't totally wall off immediately. So you got a chance if a player's kind of being a douchebag and hiding out over here. You know, you kind of got a few areas or a few ways to get them with, like, grenades and stuff. Or even to come around and go over this wall, uh, which we'll get to that area in a bit, too. And you can actually shoot through here, too, so keep that in mind. Grab a claymore there if you really want to. Uh, not much help there. You got the um, submachine gun kind of in this area here that you can kind of crawl in. I wouldn't recommend doing that. Uh, but you can see the hitbox is big enough that you usually pick it up without even having to go down there. So that's cool. You got a wrench here. Uh, you actually start with the knife. You don't start with the crossbow. So that's a nice little like decision there. Crossbow, especially like you know, if ammo's a little scarce, can actually be a little bit helpful here. But that's probably not going to happen too often. Still, it is there if you if you do so choose to get it. Grab some magnum armor here. Or armor. Pfft, ammo. Uh, not really much point to this little enclove here. So don't try, try not to come this way. Uh, this will lead into the one building we'll get to here. And that is about it for the courtyard. Uh, you can't go out here. I thought you could at one but when I first played this map. But no, that's just to look like, you know. Aesthetic! Aesthetic. And like, you see what I mean I was saying? Uh, like, it has an aesthetic. It's got nice lighting in the skybox, which I think might be custom. I'm not too sure. Uh, looks really nice, but, you know, again, it's very basic looking. Uh, the building's inside more so. Like, you know, they're not, it's like, they're kind of just empty. But, you know, I think that was the, kind of the point to keep the, like, you know, the flow going. There's not a whole lot of things to get caught on. So, if you come to this little area here, you gotta be careful because there's a big, obviously, it's very long range and open. So someone might take advantage of that with like with some of the long range weapons. You got yet another MP5, like um, MP5, which is great, or 40. I don't know. I don't know the names of any of the rapid fire weapons. I think this is the MP5, and that's the MP4. I fucking don't know. Anyway, grab some ammo for it. Always a fun time, guaranteed for all. Uh, you can throw things over, but uh, you yourself cannot jump over. I might add. So don't try to do that. But again, that helps if someone's being a jerk with the uh, like sniper rifle there. Uh, you can get on top here to grab some, you know, batteries. Um, I guess you can hump the, like, the shelf here too, but I don't really recommend it. Grab some, uh, health though. And if you come into this little area here, you gotta crawl to get into it, of course. You can grab the, uh, Desert Eagle, whatever the hell it's called, and you can grab a satchel. And, uh, yeah, that's the map. Like I said, it's very, very basic. But, you know, it actually works extremely well, and it's actually really damn fun. 
Uh, check it out. I've said it before. I really do wish more maps would be kind of set at sunset like this. You know, just gets the... Just get, it gets me in the mood, ironically, enough to, like, you know, kill some people, even though, you know, it's kind of like, you know, usually people associate sunsets with, like, more calmness. It's a weird thing, I know. Feel free to booby-trap that area, assuming you don't die immediately like I did. I'm doing really piss poor, but again, my mouse just decides... It gets in a mood. I don't know why I insist on using the Sega Saturn mouse I have. The shuttle mouse, if you will, for absolutely every, like, one of these map videos. It just feels right at this point. It's like a tradition. It probably might help, too, if I clean my mouse pad at some point. That might fix some of the issues I have with this. But I've just been so busy. I'm, I'm frankly shocked I'm even recording this right now. I'm on vacation, so hopefully that means I can get a ton of these videos out. But knowing me, it probably means I'll just... I won't put another, out a single other video until my vacation's over. I wouldn't be surprised. I, I would almost take bets on it, really. Come on, get that snipe. We gotta get these six... Ah! Oh! See, that's the problem, too. Why this map is better than it might look, because look, you try to grab that sniper, um, you know, someone's gonna be firing at you. Like, maybe when it's just dueling, you know, you might be able to get away with it, but you know, if there's a ton of people out here, they're probably, like, you know, I guarantee they're gonna be prioritizing you a little bit. Uh, and... Oh, God! You see that Neko Arc Destiny Bubbles? I can't remember which one it is, just running at me there. That was fucking terrifying. Yeah, let's do the trap thing I brought up. Oh, it's so good. Oh, that's... Oh, God. I guess you're gonna be... Watch out if you're gonna do that, though, because it can, in fact, hit the bars on the gate, whatever it's supposed to be. Shot... Like, tragic. Throw caution to the wind. Oh, you jealous of me, sniper, that I got a sniper rifle? Come on, now. Oh! I actually got a headshot. I can't believe it. I'm actually, frankly, flabbergasted. What are you doing? Are you kidding me? Did you see that? Did you see that no-scope on Destroyer there? I don't know what happened, but I, I didn't even hit who I intended to hit, but I hit someone anyway. God damn, I'm gonna- oh, I want to go MLG Pro. Oh well. Can't have everything. Get the goddamn satchel, Claymore, whatever it is. I don't know what this is anymore. Damn it! Well, that- that was a good way to finish things off. A Warzone, it's- it's actually lit. You should probably check it out. 